All right, we're, we're going to... Just talk it through. Yeah, what is this resolve triangle pose? Revolve triangle pose. Oh, right? I can't see that good. Yeah. <laughs> Revolve triangle pose. So in Sanskrit, that's where you start Dukonasana. Oh, and asana in Sanskrit just means any pose. Okay. Right, so for yoga, you always hear asana at the end of the word when they say it in Sanskrit. So for this pose, it's really great for your spine, your chest, and your shoulders. You are twisting your spine, and also while you are twisting your spine, you are finding balance and in holding it and not falling over to one side. And for this one, you want to make sure that you have square hips when you do it so that it helps your shoulders open up. Yeah. Is there a counter pose to this or? Counter pose would be doing it on the other side. Okay. And then the next pose would be? So the next pose is warrior two. This one is great for your hips, to open your hips, especially if you have um, knee pain or tight, tight hips. Is that what you would say it? What is a warrior pose? Just describe it to me briefly. Sorry? I'll cut it. What do you mean by warrior pose? What does it look like? Oh, warrior pose. So you have like three variations of warrior pose, right? So it would go. <laughs> to do this. So this would be like warrior two. Oh, okay, the, okay, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm doing this. The okay. warrior two, it's like you're facing the side like that, and then you're just. That's the one with the arrow. I think it looks like an arrow. Um. My friend had a picture of that. Yeah, 